It is such a beautiful day out today, and that puts a smile on my face. And since you want to see me more happy in my videos, I think I got just the challenge. But first, we need to go to a happy place. Go to a happy place. Parks the place for smiles. Doo -doo -doo. If this isn't enough to make me smile, then there's no hope for me. I got something real special for you today. I guarantee you won't find a challenge like this out there anywhere unless you're in my area. And we have this restaurant, it's a classic diner style called Eaton Park, and they're known for their smiley cookies. And it's basically a sugar cookie with icing with a smiley face painted on it. Well, not painted, but iced. Anyway, I decided to get 50, four dozen, two extra. I weighed one of them, it was like one and three quarter ounces. So times 50, it's like a little over five and a half pounds. Each cookie is about 240 calories. So I think this is doable. It's reminiscent of that Pop-Tart challenge to me, so. When everything gets too much, I got my condiments, my spreadables. I got something special for a certain subscriber that recommended I try something. So hopefully we get that far. Little backstory about Eden Park. They were founded in the Pittsburgh area, which is where I'm from, back in 1949. And actually, I think it was June 6th, which will be the day after I'm posting this. Classic diner food. They started out as car hops. They got locations now in West Virginia, Ohio, and PA. So if you're in the area, I would recommend stopping by. I used to go there as a kid and I think you used to get these for free. I don't remember, I never paid. Anyway, I'll put the calories as I go along and I'm gonna count everything at the end, like my condiments and my drink. That being said, just the cookies will be up on the screen. And we'll get started. Let's I pour my milk, fat-free of course. We are underway. Nothing like it. Okay, the first two are done. And as to be expected, things are going great. How I can describe these for you? If you're lucky enough and lucky enough to have tried the sugar cookie pop tarts around Christmas season, similar to that. But if you want to give them a try, it says you can order them at smileycookie.com. Let's keep going. First dozen, plus the other two, 14 down. And I gotta say, things are going pretty smoothly. But, not because it's too much. I wanna have a little fun. So it's time to spruce things up a little bit. Now if you're a fan of the Takedown Twins, as I am, you know what's coming. I gotta try this out for myself, see what all the hype's about. We got strawberry cream cheese spread because why not? And I got the great value brand because budget, unfortunately. And hopefully they're watching. So I'm gonna do a dollop that would make them proud. Good enough, guys. We're gonna make a sandwich. Oh. oh man. Mm. Mm. Wow, that is so good. 
Mm. Oh man. Wow, man. That is just something you gotta try. Oh man. Oh. Up next, we had to go with cookie butter. Now I would have got crunchy, but I can't find it. Eh, it's okay. It's not appropriate in this setting though. I don't think I'll be coming back to that. <clears throat> you knew it was coming. You just knew. Better than Biscoff, still doesn't top that cream cheese. Not bad. Our last spreadable peanut butter. Now I would have gone with Jif, but right now I'm not trying to get salmonella. So Skippy was the only kind they had other than generic. <clears throat> Just got a whiff of something. Just making sure it wasn't the peanut butter. Better than the Nutella. Overall winner has to be that cream cheese spread, but I underestimated one thing, how much these dry out your mouth. And I'm using way too much milk. <clears throat> Second dozen is down, which brings us to 26. And don't let these little guys fool you. They are dense. And I have no idea how long I've been eating. It's gotta be like a half hour by now. There's no speed eating these. You just don't know what they do to your mouth. But I'm getting hot, so gotta get rid of that hat. All right, let's go, let's keep going. Resorting to dunking, I should have done that sooner. I could have saved so much, so much space. I don't think that surprise is going to happen because at this point, I think the real surprise would be me actually finishing. Got 12 more to go. And this is the part. We just gotta hunker down, dig deep, and fight to the finish. I'm gonna regret this later, but being as there's only two left, I felt like I had to finish with a cream cheese sandwich. Because it was the only pairing worth using. Oh, and I'm gonna regret this tomorrow. Just like that, everybody. That is 50 Eaton Park Smiley Cookies. Oh. So, I'm gonna weigh everything. I'm not drinking the rest of that milk. And I'll calculate the calories and give you a total. I did do a pre-challenge physique update and I'll post that. We get cleaned up and I'll show you the post-challenge. And before this challenge, I had a lot to smile about because for the first time in months, not only did I complete a challenge, but earlier I weighed myself and I was sub 200. I believe I was 197. So I'll show you that. Until next time, I hope I made my hometown proud. If you liked the video, I'd appreciate it if you gave a thumbs up. Comment something down below. Subscribe if you haven't already. And until the next one, peace. And stay happy. Stay positive. It gets better. So I'm told.